excited for today's episode. It's a kicking good time. Get it? Because of karate kick? No. You definitely kicked me in the leg. That's, that hurt. But. It's just the name of the game. We're it's okay. Name of the game. Well, we have an, an awesome episode coming up. This past week, in case you missed it, it was our spring break camp, and we are gonna be recapping all of our favorite segments that happened this past week. Yeah, so if you missed it, our theme for the week was emojis. Mm -hmm. so the first segment that we're gonna show you is something called human emojis, where we went and surprised our staff and our students with an emoji, and they had to recreate it using their face. Uh, Just like that. Let's take a look. Hey girls, make this face. Make this face. Hey Ryan, do this face. What's that face? Inez, make this face. Make this face. Hey Eden, make this face. Hey Phil, do this face. Wow, that is um... That's my human emoji face. That, I don't know, what emoji are you trying to be? Excited. <laughs> I've never seen that one before. Well, it's a new one. we had a ton of fun at camp last week, mm -hmm. and one of our other favorite segments was SASN. Super amazing sports segment. network. It was one of my favorite segments, and we had, there's multiple games each day, but one of them was clearly my favorite. The yeah. floor is lava. Let's go take a look at what our teams did and how well they competed. Let's go. Welcome back everyone. It is your host, Mikel Phelps. And I'm Michael Gordon. And this is SASN, the super amazing sport network. We have an incredible brand new game. The floor is lava. You played it as kids, we played it as kids. It is one of my personal favorites and I don't think our teams are gonna disappoint us today. Nope. It is gonna be a great game. Let's throw it to our eye in the sky, the man on the floor, Tony Baller, and see what is happening today. All right, and welcome back to our amazing game show. Today we have an incredible game for all of you viewers, all you awesome PC Kids viewers at home. We are playing the one, the only, Floor is Lava. Here's how it's gonna work. Teams are gonna start at the top of our playground, down the slide, across our very dangerous, tipsy obstacles. But it's not just that simple, folks. There are the opposing teams on either side throwing giant balls of death to try and knock them off. If they knock off, they start again. Fastest team wins. Who are you cheering for at home? Are you ready, Orange Team? No. Yeah. All right, we are gonna start in three, two, one, go! All right, that was incredible first round. Now we have up the one, the only, the green dinosaurs. Are you ready, guys? Yeah. yeah. All right, here we go in three, two, one. Here we go! Oh, oh you can start again. Your feet touch the ground. Your feet touch the ground. <laughs> All right, here we are, round three. It's been looking good so far. Lots of potential injuries, but nothing ready yet. Are you ready, Blue? Yes, we are. Are you gonna get injured? Yes. yes. Perfect, we are gonna start in three, two, one, go! Thank you. 
We're gonna have to call it on that one, guys. Blue team, many wipeouts, broken obstacles. It's a bad day. <laughs> what a game. All right, here we go with our last team of the day for the floor is lava. Purple team, are you ready? Yes, sir. Do you think you're gonna fall? Yes. yes. I believe in you. In three, two, one, here we go! team absolutely getting demolished in Flores Lava. Let's throw it back to our host at SASN. I'm gonna get hit with a ball. I'm your host, Tony Baller. We'll see you tomorrow. Wow, what an amazing game. That game was hot. That game was hot. That was a great little segment there for the Flores Lava. Seriously, green team and red team absolutely demolishing that course. Yeah, they killed it. They they just ran through it like they did it yesterday. The other teams, if they were still there, they would still be running through it because they were garbage today. <laughs> yeah, they were hot garbage. Hot garbage! Yeah. The floor is lava, lava is hot. That is how that works. Seriously though, some of those wipeouts, ow, e, they are gonna be in the ICU. Absolutely getting some stitches, I think. Oh, absolutely. All right, well, hopefully they heal up and they will be ready for our next set of games and our last set of games tomorrow on our final segment here at SASN. Thank you for joining us today on SASN. We are going to throw it back to Pastor Ryan and Pastor Matty. I am your host, Mikel Phelps. And I'm Michael Gordon. We'll see you tomorrow. That was so much fun. I loved watching them compete. Seriously. And you know what I love even more than watching people compete? What? Watching people have to do the Wheel Unfortunate. Seriously. It's not that was actually week. my favorite part of the week because you and I didn't have to do it. Yeah, we were safe the whole week, but our students had to do some pretty unfortunate mm. challenges. So, so we're going to show you what some of those were. Let's take a look. Ah. <laughs> All right, welcome back. We have another round of Wheel Unfortunate. Yesterday was terrible. I'm hoping today is gonna be even worse. I hope they get Deadly Smoothie. It is my favorite one. I love watching people throw up. It's my favorite. All right, next up we have the purple team is today's terrible unfortunate guest. Come on, guys. Round of applause, yes. Get nice and close. The camera, the, the people wanna see you. The people wanna see you. All right, let's spin that wheel and see what terrible thing you get in three, two, one. Here we go, here we go. Are you guys nervous? Are you nervous? What are you gonna get? What are you gonna get? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Let's see, let's see, let's see. What are we gonna get? What are we gonna get? What are we gonna get? Nobody ever knows. Kiss, Kiss of fish! Oh! I gotta go catch a good old Lake Ontario smacker and see if we can lay some kisses on it. Here we go! All right, we are here. It is kiss of fish time. I have Henry and Emma. Those are beautiful fish, Pastor. Yeah, Henry and Emma. I caught them in the lake this morning. They smell um, fresh. Yeah, they smell fresh from the lake. I still, oof, wow, those really smell terrible. Look. Hello! One person's gonna have to kiss the face, one person's gonna have to kiss the butt, the one button. person's gonna have to kiss the face. It's okay. So, purple team, come on in, grab a seat. Okay, so, first up, Mr. Jaden. I have Mrs. Emma here, and she wants to say hi. You have to kiss the fish for five seconds. Okay. There we go. Close your eyes. I like to not plug my nose. No, you can't plug your nose. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> All right, close your eyes, you'll never know. <laughs> This is so... <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one! Oh, all right. Callie, I'm gonna get you to take off your mask. Are you ready? No. No? Okay, it's gonna be all right. Back. Okay. <laughs> don't worry, Hal, don't, don't, don't worry. Okay. Three, two, 
Holly, come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Good job, Holly. Mr. Jasper, you get the butt. It's starting to thaw out a little bit, so he might come back alive and like a little right in the face. Ten, here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Fish slap, in the eye. Get the fish. Final kiss get the of too. the day. You get the butt too. Five, Five, four, four three, three, two, two one. Yo, Good job, guys. Say, this guy, he's gone, he's gone. But he just did like the biggest kiss, man. He just did the biggest kiss. I'm so proud of him. He just ran out of the building. I don't know where he went. Unfortunate. Guys, unfortunate? Very, yeah. very unfortunate. Wow, those were disgusting and horrible and super unfortunate. And I'm glad that you and I didn't have to do any of those. Yeah, but next week we'll be back with I more know. real unfortunate and one of us is I, going to have I feel to like my luck has run out. I feel like I've been very lucky recently. Well, I've been winning a lot of games. Because I have a good feeling about our new series. I have a feeling that I'm gonna start winning again. I'm gonna get back on that streak. I really hope not. Well, there's only one way to find out. Come back next week and watch our episode. Okay, and then our final and last segment that we checked in with every single day was one of our favorite characters, Professor Finkelbottom. He was here all week working on this secret He's a crazy project. Guy. His emotions were all over the place, this guy. So many emotions. But at the final and last day, he unveiled his secret project to us, and we want to give you guys a glimpse as to what that was. Take a look at what he built. Okay. You know, we've been practicing with this. You do not need to worry. Just do what you've been told to do, okay, little tennis ball? Do it for me. Oh, I'm so afraid this isn't going to work and everybody's gonna make fun of me. Professor Finkelbottom, what's what? going on? It's, How are you feeling? I think I finished my big secret project. You finished? That's so exciting. Yes, but I'm afraid it's, what if it doesn't work? You're afraid. Of I'm that. so afraid. If it doesn't work, and then no one will take my my very serious work seriously, and then no one will think I'm an actual professor, and then all right. the tennis balls will revolt, and they will come and they will get me. Okay. Well, you know what, Professor Finkelbottom? Today we've been learning that it's okay to feel afraid, but when we feel those feelings, we can actually know that Jesus is with us. And even if your secret project doesn't work out, mm -hmm. God is still with you. So he's even with me when I'm afraid? Exactly. Even, Every minute Even of the if day. the tennis balls come alive and try and get me? Yep, no matter what happens. He's still with me. So I think you should show us your secret project. Okay, please water. don't make fun of me, children. Don't it's, be afraid, it's, it's gonna be okay. Okay, dokie. All right, let me get in the position and then okay. you need to step back in case anything falls okay. and crushes you. Okay, I'm so excited. You. This is gonna be amazing, right? Okay, yes, yes. 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 It's gonna be great. Yes. Okay. Here we go. Okay, little tennis ball. Let's see your magic. Here we go. It's going to go down there into the tube. Okay, and then it's going to come out and it drops down. Okay, into the zigzag tubes of awesome. Okay, and slow down. Don't go too fast. We don't want you to get hurt. Yes, very good. Very good. And then stop. Don't fall. Okay, good. And then go. Hit the tennis ball. And then that goes. And then he rolls down the thing in the jigger. cleaning team to come clean this mess up. Yeah, that's gonna be your fault. Have fun! No! Bye bye kiddos! Well that was amazing. I don't know how he built that to work with like the balls all yeah, just like, hitting everything and then the pyramid. Seriously, it probably took him forever. Mess. Huge mess. He better clean that up because I last I checked he still had it cleaned that up and I do not want to have to be the one to put that no, stuff. We're gonna hold him accountable. He will clean up his mess. Seriously. Don't worry. But guys, so we've been learning all about emotions this week. Pastor Maddie did an amazing job, and so she's gonna give you guys a quick recap as to what happened. Teach us about emotions. 
Well, on day number one, we talked about anger versus self-control. We talked about the fact that we all get angry sometimes when things are unfair, when things don't go our way. But with God's help, we can have self-control. And we cannot act out on our anger, but instead ask God to give us self-control to calm down and to express our anger in a healthy way. Yeah, that way we're not like Sorry. Finkelbottom destroying all the cups. Exactly. Professor Finkelbottom had a little bit of an anger issue, but he learned after a little bit of time that God can help him with his anger. Seriously. On day two, we learned about sadness versus joy. Mm -hmm. You know, we all experience sadness, especially in this season. A lot of things can make us feel upset or sad. But you know what, when God comes into our life, he promises to give us joy. And mm -hmm. joy is different than happiness, yeah. right? Because happiness is based on what happens to us. It's based on our circumstances. Yeah. But joy is different because we can have joy through every circumstance, through mm -hmm. every situation, because God is with us and He is good. So good, so amazing. And then what was what did we learn on our last yeah, day? Yeah, on the last day, we learned about the difference between fear and peace. Mm. Fear is a real emotion that we all feel, and I'm yeah. sure that you know what that's like. Yeah. And you know what God says, that even when we feel afraid, we are not alone. Yeah. We learn that God is with us in every single situation, no matter how scary, and He promises to give us peace in those scary yeah. times. Especially even right now, in a time where things are a little bit crazy. We know we're not going back to school tomorrow like you guys were originally thinking. Like, mm -hmm. it can be a little worrisome right now, but God can give us peace in these times when we don't know what's going on. God promises to be there, and His Holy Spirit's always there to comfort us and look after us when we don't really know what to do. Yeah, so whatever emotion you're feeling, God is with you and He wants to help you to deal with those emotions in a healthy way. Whether it's anger, whether it's sadness, yep. or whether it's fear, God is with you and He is gonna help you get through those big emotions. So good, such an amazing week at camp. And the last thing, we would end it every single uh, every single day, we ended with our memory verse. And so yeah. for in case these kids missed it, or in case you were there and you've already forgotten it with the brains of not good thinking, let's memorize and do our verse one more time. All right. The kids. All right, let's get ready to do our memory verse. Get up on your feet and do it along with us. This with time us. we have like a little bit of a dance, a little bit of a song. A little bit so of a jingle see, perhaps? You, If you can keep up. Okay. Ready? Ready? Here okay, we go. Let's do it. Don't, Don't worry, worry about, about anything. anything. Instead, Instead, pray about everything. everything. Tell God, God what you need and thank, thank him for all he's done. Philippians 4, 6, That's the freestyle part. Whatever you want to do. Let's do it again. Okay, one more time. Ready? One. Ready? Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Don't worry about anything. Instead, pray about everything. Tell God what you need and thank Him for all He's done. Philippians 4, 6, 6, 7, So guys, this has been a little bit of a recap of what we did over camp this week. If you did perhaps miss it, don't worry. You can check them out. They are on YouTube. Go check out our page, Spring Break Camp 2021. It was a lot of fun. Even if you did watch it, watch it again. Watch, watch it, it 10, 17 times. million more times. As and many then, times as you want. Yeah, like a bajillion. Until you have the whole thing memorized. Until you have the whole thing memorized better than me. Yep. That would be great. Well, guys, it has been awesome. Thank you guys for joining us. And you're going to want to make sure you are here next Sunday because we are starting our brand new series. It's a surprise. It's a surprise. It's a surprise. I can't tell you what it is, it's but it's going to be awesome. So you're going to want to make sure you are here tuning in. Tell your friends, tell your family, tell your grandma, tell your pet parakeet Pablo. And we will see you guys next Sunday here on PC Kids Online. See you later. Bye, guys.